What is that sound they hear? Something is amiss, I fear. Miss Clavel, it seems, has caught a cold. Now, let this narrative unfold. You are unwell, Miss Clavel? Do not worry, little girls. I will be better. Too sweet. <laughs> I do without you. Ah, oh, this is not good. You must stay in bed. But my girls... They will look after you. Oh, my head. It already aches so badly. The disturbance, it seems, came from next door, at the house of the Spanish ambassador, where Pepito was, so to speak, settling a score. doing? Mama insists I learn to play the violin. Pepito, Miss Clavel is not well. Your music is hurting her head. Oh. Perfecto! I will tell Mama no violin till Miss Clavel is better. Till tomorrow. <coughs> Keep her warm and give her love. She will recover soon enough. Merci, Dr. Cohen. There. All tucked in. Miss Clavel, you may play with my marbles. They will cheer you up. Thank you, ma petite. But you keep them. I know how you treasure them. Do not worry, mes enfants. You make me happy. Tomorrow, I will be better. <laughs> and I will take care of you. Miss Clavel went to sleep as the girls tiptoed out. Wake up. Quiet now. That evening at bedtime, they still had some doubts. <sighs> what more can we do for Miss Clavel? Papa reads books to me when I am sick. Il était une fois. <coughs> Grandmama makes me her special onion soup. Oh, c'est bon. Mama comes home late from her performances. But we still play with my dolls. <laughs> I remember, Mama would let me stay in her bed and brush my hair. 
She let me wear the necklace Papa gave her when they first met. But not anymore. Huh. At least you still have your families. I have no one now. <laughs> Pauvre Madeleine! <laughs> no family! How sad! Something is not right. Something is quite wrong. Little girls, what is wrong? We are sorry, Miss Clavel. We are feeling sad because poor Madeline has no family. Mes enfants, do not forget. We are not only born into families, we can also find them. Just as we have found each other. Families come in all shapes and sizes. Is it the same, Miss Clavel? I do not think so. What do we say at each meal? We love our bread. We love our butter. But most of all, we love each other. Perhaps it is so. I know it is. But Miss Clavel, you must go back to bed. You will get more sick. And then where will we be? I will go to bed if you will go to bed. I will go to sleep if you will go to sleep. Will you have sweet dreams if we have sweet dreams? Oui, ma chérie. The morning arrived, and the postman as well, with a letter addressed to care of Miss Clavel. Bonjour, Miss Clavel. How are you feeling? Much better, ma petite. Merci. Lala. An announcement? An invitation? A birthday card? For whom? Madeline? Oui, Miss Clavel? Knit love from your long-lost Uncle Orst? I am part of a family! I have an uncle! From Vienna! And he's coming here to see me! Same every year! Girls, girls, we must prepare. Everything must be ready for Madeline's Uncle Horst. He's her family. Mm -hmm.